I want to ask you about Mo3. He passed away when you were locked up. Mm -hmm. um, you, you knew Mo3. I talked to him one time. One time. Through Bay Bay. Through Bay Bay. Yeah. What, um, what did you think about that when you first heard about it? Oh, man, I hated it because he was, he was special. So you got guys that are good. You got guys, you know, just because you get a big record, that don't make you special. That means you got you got a special record, you know. But he was a special artist. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. So, you know, I'm trying to really, like you talked about my son, I want to get, you know, get it in, mm. run up the bag, and get my label started, move on to do some work with stuff. him. Of course, get my son in position. Right. In my city. Because Fort Worth rolled for me. Man, so all of those horror stories with everybody up, man, Fort Worth oh, rolled Dallas. for me. Yeah, they, yeah. Have, they have a lot Dallas of love. Dallas rolled for me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm yeah. talking about supporting me. Tom, Chief, um, uh, Tuck, man, uh, J-Dog out in Houston. Man, they, they kept my name alive. Wow, so, Mr. Man, Lucci kept, was in here, too. Lucci, man, yeah. he did Mr. something Lucci. for Yeah, because I, I saw where you said that, and I was trying to figure out how hard is it for you to do recording um, a verse or anything there and then send it out to get it mixed and mastered with somebody else how hard is that it, for anybody else it would be super hard but there's this guy named jeff at session works again who would answer every call he would mix every song and have it sound like glass breaking for nothing mm. so i know this was just guy making provision so for me to come out here and get on foolishness then you know i'm really I'm snub, you know, snubbing my nose. Mm -hmm. guy. I'm not gonna do that. So, yeah, mm. you know, I'm a, I'm gonna come out here and make music, and I guarantee you, anybody on the track that get a feature or want a feature or whatever, I'm a, I'm a punish them. That's what I do. I want to ask you about Mo three. He passed away when you were locked up. Mm -hmm. right? um, you, you knew Mo three. I talked to him one time. One time. Bay Bay. Through Bay Bay. Yeah. What, um, what did you think about that when you first heard about it? Oh man, I, I hated it because he was he was special. So you got guys that are good. You got guys, you know, just because you get a big record, that don't make you special. That means you got you had a special record, you know. But he was a special artist, you know. Just listening to him, very very talented. He just had it. He had that it factor, how they right. call it, you know what I mean? And and to find out that he passed, you know, I hate to see him go so fast. You know what but I mean? how shocked were you at? how he passed 11. in broad daylight 11. that's something you don't see on that on any major highway i've been here in texas 20 years and i've never heard nothing like that before yeah well that part about it didn't shock me much because i i mean i don't i don't know him i didn't know him like that or what he was into but i just you know you know the street you know, the word i got made it to the street they say he was in the street so in the street you know the street don't have lights so it ain't really it's no. Just, it's, it's, all, they it's don't all care where. Yeah, yeah, it's, wow. yeah, yeah, it's all fair game in the streets. Yeah, you know how to, you know. Yeah, it ain't so, no. It can happen right. anywhere. Wherever yeah, I see you on site, they say. On site. The young, mm. the young niggas say on site. Yeah. The old niggas been following there for years. Yeah, that's true. You know what I'm saying? So, man, like, yeah, you didn't know I've been at that peeping tongue, man. It, it's closed now, ain't yeah, it? Yeah, no, I, I already <laughs> pulled up. <laughs> <laughs> we were young, what we been? Yeah. Yeah. Boy, that was a long time ago, man. Now, I posted your gold card the other day. Did you? Remember? You know, I still got the gold card. They was so. laughing. They were laughing. I told them I had it. These niggas trying to play with me, man. Yeah. I get on this show and act up. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> well, they should have never gave me no cameras, man. You know what I'm saying? You got plenty, you got plenty of them. <laughs> so my next plenty. question is, so did you know Big Pokey? Oh, oh yeah, yeah. He, that that happened since just, you been out, right? Yeah, I was just a fan. Okay, so how, when you heard about what happened, what did you think? Um, I still really don't know what happened. I just know he passed. I yeah, maybe yeah. A, I think they said it was heart condition. Yeah, it was condition. a heart yeah, condition. That's what I'm about to say. So you know, I hate that man. You know. Yeah. Uh, and again, with soon. social media, the thing that I can't stand with social media is that yeah, everything, you know that. Everything, <clears throat> everything, everything happens right, in your face. right there before you know. Back in before social media is like okay, it's a protocol. Let me notify the family. Let right. me float, you know before they put it on the news and everything like that. Right. But if you're out in the open, everybody, the first thing everybody do is take up their phone and start videoing. Yeah. ESG, and it goes straight to social media. ESG texts me, FaceTime mm -hmm. me, really. And I didn't answer it. And then I look back and I text him, and he say, "Man, uh, E." He say, Big Pokey dead. I like, what? It's like three in the morning, bro. Mm -hmm. He hit me like that. Cause me and him, you know, we, we talk and I was like, that, <clears throat> that messed me up, man. Because it's so crazy how these same cameras and these phones and these cameras on these phones, you can have fun with them one day. But then the next day they can turn on you. 
You know what I'm saying? They a can be something curse. totally different, bro. Right. And it's crazy how, and I, you adjusting to how these cameras are coming out because anything you do yeah. can. Yeah. And I will be we used yeah. against you. Yes. Uh, <laughs> baby had hit me to that early on. She really, really, man, again, I tell you, she the best thing happened to mm -hmm. me out of, you know, out of, coming out of, I mean, with this whole experience. But she had been trying to get me help. You know, hey, she told me, Everybody's. It's always somebody recording, mm -hmm. and I, and I kept that in my head. Then you know, of course, we watch TV, and I'm like, you can see somebody fall and hurt themselves, and the first thing they do is this. Yeah, uh -huh. it's not try to help them up. Yeah. <clears throat> so, please, if you see me, I, I don't mind you taking pictures and all that. Don't run up, put your camera in my face. Mm -hmm. They'll I'm do not it. Really used to that. You They'll do I mean? it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know they will, and I'm not gonna go crazy. No, because they did it to me that. a lot of times. Yeah, that's, that's tough. And you got to be, you got to understand, man, a lot of these people have, a lot of, even celebrities have accepted it, and people that they run into accept it. That's what leads these people down these, yeah. these roads. So Because it you, becomes norm. It, it becomes norm, because you done seen it, you mm -hmm. done seen it. As soon as they, they come out with it at the Kroger's on me, they come out with it at the store on me. I come out the store with my hoodie on. This is the stuff that they do. Cause they want to be, they man. They excited to see you. They ain't yeah. ever seen. They see you like on this set. You gonna they, this, on on real life. All of this stuff, man, is amplifying who you are and you own. Right. And when they see you, oh, they gonna express it, bro. But the crazy thing about it, like for us, like we just think of ourselves as regular people. Yeah, right. So just because right. and all of this, just like how you say you feel so comfortable because of who we are, but we don't think of celebrities or anything like that. But people, when they see you on their phones are on the TV because they might put it on TV. Oh my God, you made it. You're a celebrity. You're this, you're that. But I'm like, but we not. We right. just regular people. Regular, regular people. people. Yeah. And, 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 and the same old two step. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know what I'm saying? So what top three artists of all time, dead or alive? Um, Any genre. Any genre. Number one. Wow, that's a good one. I know. That's what we do. <clears throat> that's, that's a regular question. You know. <laughs> Number one. one. Michael Jackson. That we get that. Usual. Number, Number two. two. Let me see if you're going to do the regular one, two, three. Um, Frankie Beverly. Oh, okay. That's hard. That's hard. That's man. different. Number three. Damn, only three. <laughs> only that's three. That's it. That's what everybody say, too. Same Prince. <laughs> Prince, yeah. Okay. That's a, that's I like that. Yeah. That's People a, normally I say like that Tupac, top three. Prince, and um, Michael Jackson. Well, yeah. if we if we were in rap, but when you no, it's any genre. Yeah, I know, but so I can't. This is only me. There's no comparison in talent with the um, with the greats, Mike's and the Princes and the Frank. Frank the the feeling Bell. you get when you hear that music is not unbelievable. Yeah, I get it. And, and I still didn't get a chance to name Anita Baker. Shot Ooh, you know, Anita Baker, like, go hard. Hey, no, you had to cut them out. Yeah, yeah. No, but the uh, Whitney Houston's. <clears throat> Gotta cut them Houston, out. Of course. No, no so I, so right. I, I really hope you drop that. Uh, album. I hope I hope you don't. Cause what you felt is that on the sixteenth. Yeah, what you felt in there. I mean, I think it's something to it. You right. know what I'm saying? It is. To it's be something hurt, to man. it, bro. Yeah. And yeah. unless you want to hold back and then do it a little later on, so kind of weave them. Together. Weave them together. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Drew and ever Drew and Wire looking that way. I'm gonna weave it. <laughs> <laughs> Me and nephew gonna shoot it out. Man, but I, it, it's tough though. It, it, but as you know, I was in my jail frame of mind. But it's good music. I'm talking mm -hmm. about it's good. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk.